If you're on the market for smart path lights that connect with your favorite home assistant, including HomeKit, and score really high on the style chart, then we'll take a look at the Villanary smart path lights. Let's go. What's going on guys? Welcome to Dial Home Tech. I'm Dial and here in this channel we talk about smart home technology, home automation, and we do some tech reviews as well. If that's something that interests you, then please consider subscribing to the channel and don't forget to click the little bell, which alerts you every time a new video comes out. I really want to thank Villanary for sending out these lights for this feature video, um, but they will be seeing this video at the same time as you guys are. This is a feature video and not a paid review. So let's get started with showing you guys what's inside of each of these boxes. They sent out a couple of boxes and these Villanary Pathlight boxes come in two forms. The first one is that you can buy a set of three lights, which is a starter pack. One of the lights will act as a bridge, so you don't need to purchase an additional bridge. And the second box is a single unit, so you can purchase as many of these units as you want uh, in order to add to your string of lights. Right off the bat, I was taken by the quality of these lights. They're sturdy, they're made out of die-cast metal, and the colors on these lights will just not fade. Um, they are heavier than your usual path lights, but that's because they're made out of metal and not plastic. And that right there tells you that this is a very good quality light. Villanary themselves have done some tests and they ran over a light with a car. And I'll show you a video and you can see the quality on these things are just made to last. These lights are very durable and Villanary claims that they will last up to 20 years. That's just because of the choice of metal that they use and you can see it on the premium quality of the finish from each light you're looking at. They're high voltage lights so they won't fade over time and you can string up to 20 lights on a single line for a max of 320 feet. So you can keep adding lights onto these things and the performance will just not change. They have a nice efficient lumen output, which gives you that big full ring right around the light. So it's not just a little path light that will light up one little area. These things go 360 degrees and they light up up to eight feet. So you get a lot of good lighting uh, in your pathway. Even if it's in a dark or tight spot, the lights just kind of bleed across the yard. So it's a really, really nice um, light output filling in all those empty spaces uh, in those dark spaces as well. When it comes to the installation and connectivity of these lights, the best thing about them is that they connect with your favorite home assistant. And that will include HomeKit, Amazon Alexa, as well as Google Assistant. As far as application goals, the Villanary app was super simple to use. It was easy to connect the lights into, and I had no issues um, after the connections were made. So they work well, flawless, and now I have the ability to control them using my favorite voice assistant. These lights can be controlled via Bluetooth or Wi-Fi, which is a nice little add-on in case you want to use a different protocol in order to control your lights. The connectivity was simple, so once my light was connected to the Villanary app, I was then able to add to my favorite Home Assistant device. So you can scan the QR code for HomeKit, um, Alexa and Google will discover these devices as you would expect them to. So no hurdles or no jumping through hoops in there in order to get them set up for your home. When it comes to automations, the Villanary app also provides some, but you can always use your favorite home assistant automations. Um, but the Villanary app does provide a sunset and sunrise option where you can set the lights to come on and off a certain time or based on your location uh, as far as sunset and sunrise goes. The Villanary path lights are dimmable as well, so you don't have to have them at full strength if you don't want to, just in order to achieve that special look that you may be looking for. When it comes to installation, these lights were super easy to get it installed. It was virtually a plug and play, um, not really much to it. All you had to do is just choose how would you want it to install and place the lights in the locations that you would want them to be. Um, they do give you a few installation options there right out of the box. They will provide some uh, metal stakes that you can install it in the earth if you want to, or they will give you some brackets where you can mount them to a deck uh, in order to keep them really stationary. Now the stakes will also help you keep stationary because these are metal stakes and not some of the plastic inserts that you see on some other lights on the market. So these things, once they go on the ground, they will stay on the ground. 
Now as far as pricing goes, you can buy the 3 set for $11.99 from the Villanary store or you can also get a single unit for $5.49. These lights are extremely premium and durable and they have an awesome modern as well as classic look. So you don't have to worry about what kind of setup or what kind of house you have, these lights will fit in and look very very nice regardless of the type of look that you're trying to achieve. Now as far as connecting one light to another, they come with nice thick very premium wires with a locking mechanism that will let you know that these lights are locked in place and they're gonna be tight there and sealed against the weather too. These lights are supposed to withstand super high temperatures as well as super low temperatures. So here in New England, we have pretty much extremes all year round from super cold to very, very hot. So these lights are perfect for any place that you may be installing them. So I'm gonna leave some links to the Villanary store right in my description in case you wanna take a look at these lights and see it for yourself what they're all about. All right guys, if you enjoy what you saw, don't forget to give me a thumbs up on the video. Also, if you're into home automation and smart home technology, please consider subscribing. And I'm gonna leave a playlist right here on the side where you can check out more videos from the channel. Well, this about wraps it up guys. Thank you so much for watching. And until next time, I'm Dial. See ya.